Hey guys, welcome back for another video. So today's topic, it's going to be how to wear large breast forms for cross-dressers. Now, I've had this request ever since I made my last breast form video. How can a cross-dresser wear large breast forms and look good wearing them? Now, you need to understand that not, not all cross-dressers desire smaller cups. Some do, you know, would like larger cups like these. You know, these are a full double D and I am going to show you guys how to wear them and make them look good. Some people just desire the more voluptuous figure and that is okay. Personally, I, I prefer just my small C cups that I have if I ever do wear them, but I'm going to cover how to wear large ones. Now the bras we are going to be going over first are the non-padded. You can see no padding in these. These are the closest to the pocket bras that they make specifically for breast forms, but these are just cheaper. Then we have the more popular t-shirt bra. These, these bras you can see have a little bit more of a sturdier cup, but these work very well, especially under just plain shirts, as I'm gonna show you. And then we are going to be moving on to the full cover, like the full coverage bra that has the more sturdy padded cup in it. Now, as you can see, the padding is very light in this one, but it is a little bit thicker as opposed to the other ones. So you want to stay away from the bras that have a lot of padding everywhere, especially when you're wearing larger size breast forms. So in this video, you're going to be, you're going to see me go up to the camera a lot because I don't want to have to be, you know, editing every single shot whenever I cut off and cut on the camera. So I'll be going up to the camera a lot and just pressing it to pause the video. So we are going to start with the non-padded bra and I'm going to show you all how the breast forms look. Okay, so for video purposes, I am going to be filming the close-ups you know, just like without showing my face or anything. And this is how they look like in the non-padded bra. This is the closest that you will get to the pocket bras that they sell. Keep in mind, you don't need to spend an arm and a leg just to get the breast form, the breast form specific bras. These work just fine and they're essentially the same thing and a lot cheaper. So this is the non-padded bra. Now we are going to be going to the t-shirt bra keep in mind guys my band size is a 36 and the breast form size is a double d so let's so let me show you what it looks like in a t-shirt bra all right so this is what the t-shirt bra looks like now i am wearing a white shirt just for purposes of this video so you can see you know the shape what they look like and all that but don't wear a dark bra under a white shirt. I think I've said that before in a video. But anyways, so the t-shirt bras, these are very, very popular because they smooth out and give a more rounder shape as opposed to the non-padded ones that you just saw. So a t-shirt bra is also a very, very good option for breast forms, especially large ones, because they give the lift and the smoothness that some of you might desire over the more, you know, um, non-padded look, I guess. Now, the next one and last one we're going to cover is how do large breast forms look in bras that have a full thick cup front and back? T-shirt bras are smooth with no padding or thickness whatsoever. They're made to shape. Now, let's try on this one. All right, so the final bra is this one. As you can see, this one probably gives them the most full kind of look, but some people might not like the way that a full pad, that like a full cup pad bra looks, but it's up to you guys. I personally think it looks good. I think it makes them look a lot more smoother and rounder as opposed to the non-padded and the t-shirt bra. But overall, I do like this look. And now we need to get into what to wear them with. You can't just wear large breast forms with anything. And I'm going to show you all exactly what I mean.
All right, guys, so this dress is a two-in-one of what you want to wear whenever you are using large breast forms. Now, as you all can see, this dress has a cowl neck. The cowl neck dresses, as you can see, they have like the layers that dip down right here. I don't know, I don't know if y'all can see it very well on camera, but cowl neck dresses and tops are a great thing to wear whenever you're wearing large breast forms because they flatter and make them look good. And the other thing about this dress is that, I don't know if y'all can see here, but on the side, on the side it is ruched. It has ruching right here. So it like draws it in around your hips. And overall, this is perhaps the best thing to wear whenever you're using large breast forms. Wear, wear something like a dress that has a cowl neck or a dress that wraps around here or a dress that ruches right here like this one because it really brings in your waist and it flatters your chest. Now, something else that you can wear to you know flatter your your curves and your breast forms go for blazers or cardigans like this one you know these these are the, that button these that button like right here below the bust look very very good as well blazers and cardigans that button here those are always a good option um the white shirt that i was wearing at the beginning of the video you all notice that it had like a little bit like of a u-neck that didn't it didn't go down too deep but just like right here u-neck tops are also a very very good option to wear and the other thing that you can wear with them are are tops that that have a little bit more like like of a sharp v and that cinch in the middle those kind of tops also look really good now, things that you want to avoid when you're wearing large breast forms. Avoid tops and dresses. As, as you can see that this one here, like it bunches up right here. Avoid things that bunch up here along the chest. Avoid things that have a very, very high collar. You know, if they have like a very high collar, a turtleneck, a cardigan that buttons up here, Stay away from those. Avoid tops that are extremely loose because a large chest is gonna make the top hang straight and it's gonna give you no curves and it's gonna make you look a little bit uh, disproportionate, I guess. So you want to avoid those as well. Also, when it comes to dresses and tops, wear something like this dress that has thick straps. Avoid spaghetti straps because the thick straps go very well with the wideness and largeness of the breast forms. So those are just a little bit of tips that I hope will help you guys out. And something else that I want to point out guys is that with this dress, um, I am wearing my hip enhancers. You will want to wear hip enhancers whenever you're wearing large breast forms. I'm not saying you have to, I'm just saying that whenever you go large, the male body doesn't have hips. So therefore, I do recommend, you know, hip pads whenever you're wearing large breast forms because it'll make you look very even. It'll make you look voluptuous and curvy. So I hope you all have enjoyed this video. I hope it is of some use. I hope you all enjoyed the wide landscape view. It's just hard though filming like this because I need to stand back and I cannot get my whole body into the camera. So anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. And I will see y'all in my next video and I'm going to cover wigs, where to get them, and how to wear them. Alright guys, see y'all next time. I love y'all so very much. Bye-bye. Have a great day.